So we have been talking with the director of the new way here for quite some time to make something in this uh, very strange and uh, at least for a first time visitor staircases at uh, GAM Torino. And uh, I was very happy that I started the work some days ago and uh, that this piece is completed now. Uh, actually, this is one of the uh, very first uh, interventions of mine into a museum which will stay for the future. Because I've done so many little stories in exhibition spaces, part of the A, not so white cube type of works of mine. But uh, the majority of them, actually almost all of them, they got wiped away after the show is over. And uh, luckily here, my little fellows, my little stories, they will uh, remain for the future, I hope. And uh, I worked for several days. Uh, most of the time, people, people passing by me, some of them uh, looking what I'm doing, some of them not really paying attention, which is fine. And uh, that's why I put uh, some hooks into this uh, composition, so like a bigger figures, uh, some bigger text, especially the one which starts from the very beginning, uh, saying, please don't tell the director that uh, I'm doing these doodles on the ceilings. To catch up somebody's attention, and if uh, the visitor is curious enough, uh, to go and to find uh, uh, the rest. Even though it's very hard to find all of them, even I don't know how many are they, and which are they, but uh, this is kind of the, the good thing that you have the feeling that you can't get everything. This is very important for me. Usually I'm saying, uh, when people ask me what are you doing, I say I'm telling stories in space. So here you have many stories and one like a general story in these very strange uh, spaces of the two staircases that you can get lost a little bit like in a uh, Escher, <laughs> uh, Escher uh, composition of uh, impossible architecture. Uh, even though I would say that I found my way at, uh, the end of the, at the end of the drawing sessions. As for the benches, one of them I'm sitting right now. Uh, there are 13 benches in the permanent collection. And uh, I just get the feeling that uh, I really would like to, to connect in some way the historical pieces and the contemporary pieces, which uh, some of them are also historical. And I wanted in some peculiar way to connect uh, the, the staircases along uh, with, uh, with the benches that to do something completely different physically. So you are sitting here to have a rest, to check your uh, email because there is a free um, uh, internet here, <laughs> or to look uh, work of art if you want to. What you do in the, in the stairs, basically you move or you try to find the exit of the main show which happened to be Renoir. And uh, one more reason to have the benches, to have little stories. So here the stories is actually under my feet. And it says you have these artists who are part of the art history and artists who are not part of the art history. Uh, I would love to move myself a little bit more to the artists <laughs> who are part of art history, but uh, to be modest, I will stay in the middle so far for you. So one of the reasons to do the benches is um, that uh, actually people on wheelchairs, they can't get the stories from the staircases, obvious reasons. So they might enjoy those ones. 